I'm called Deacon Neri Soyirwath from Nebi Catholic Diocese, the current head prefect of Gaba National Seminary. I was elected into this position of leadership on the 17th of March 2022, and our swearing in to take this mantle officially was on the 3rd of April 2022. Basically, as students undergoing formation to become priests in the future, Leadership is part and parcel of this formation because as a priest, by nature, you are already a leader of God's people in various aspects. Therefore, as a student in the seminary, you are as well encouraged to get these positions of leadership and go through them, perform to your best, because through this, you are going to minister to your people. Therefore, the leadership in the seminary is basically servant leadership. What do we mean by servant leadership? There is no much expectation as in like material gain from it, but the experience that you can get from being a leader in the seminary is what matters because this is going to help you in the ministry as you pastor God's people. Yeah, Gava Seminary has come of age. Gava Seminary founded in 1970. In 2020, Gaba Seminary turned 50 years. It's a very great achievement. It is a landmark for us as students of Gaba National Seminary and even the OBs out there. Therefore, preparations are already in high gear. Come 12th of November, we are all most welcome to celebrate this great achievement, this great landmark that Gaba Seminary has attained, the age of 50 years, years of formation, years of producing pastors into the field to minister to God's people. In as far as the preparations are concerned, last Friday already, 7th of this month, October, we had the public lecture that is trying to to focus on how far Gaba Seminary has gone, where we have come from, how we have maneuvered through, and where we are now. Then what do we expect in the future in as far as this formation of God's people are concerned, the future leaders in the field. Therefore, the preparations are ongoing. We celebrate, we thank God for this landmark that God should continue helping us in this process of formation that future ministers may always be found, may move through this formation house and be relevant in the field as they minister to God's chosen people. Thank you very much for listening to me. I am called Deacon Neris Oirwad from Nebi Catholic Diocese once again. Therefore, come 12th November, we are here celebrating the Golden Jubilee. I wish you God's blessings as we continue to pray to God, to continue providing more shepherds in the field, more shepherds in his field, so that the kingdom of God may be spread. Thank you very much.